We have seen that most of the surahs of the Qur'an are in the form of prayers. This relationship has been very evident regarding these last four surahs of the Hamim series. We have seen the Surah to Zuhruf and Surah to Dukhan. Both started Hamim wal Kitab al Mubin. Both of them. Now the next pair, Surah Al Jasiyah and Surah Al Ahqaf, both starting Hamim Tanzil al Kitab min al Lahi al Aziz al Hakim. Also, we find that most of these surahs begin with the mention of Quran. Now, the last surah of this series of Hamim, Surah Al Ahqaf. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Hamim. Tanzil al-Kitab min Allah al-Aziz al-Hakim. The same. The sending down of this book is from Allah, who is all authority, all powerful, and all wise. Ma khalaqna samawati wa lardha wa ma bainahum wa illa bil haq. We have not created the heavens and the earth and whatever is in between them. But with truth and for a fixed period of time. This universe will not go on and go on forever. No. This used to be the idea, maybe about a half a century back. The era of Newtonian physics. Newton, Newtonian physics. The idea was that matter has been here from ever, it will remain forever. The law of indestructibility of matter. Matter cannot be destroyed. So this world, this universe cannot come to an end. This was the idea prevalent among the physicists. But now the things have changed. Now, on the one hand they say this universe is expanding. The theory of expanding universe. And then the time will come when it will fold on itself and it will come to an end. Started from one point and it will go to the same one point again. So, Ajarin Musamma, this is not an eternal creation. وَالَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا أَمَّا أُنزِرُوا مُعْرِدُونَ As for those who have disbelieved, they are turning away from what they are being warned. قُلْ أَرَائَتُمْ مَا تَدْعُونَ مِن دُونِ اللَّهِ Say to them, See, consider whom you are calling upon besides Allah. Aruni maja khalaqku bin al ard. Please show me. What have they created in the land, in the earth? Am lahum shirku fi samawat. Or do they have any partnership in the heavens? Eetuni bi kitabi min qabli haza. Bring to me. Any book which might have been sent down before this book that I am presenting. Or asharatun min ilmin. If not a book, any remnants of knowledge. In kuntum sadiqeen. If you are truthful. وَمَنْ أَوَلُّ مِمَّنْ يَدْعُو مِنْ دُونِ اللَّهِ مَنْ لَا يَسْتَجِيبُ لَهُ إِلَى يَوْمِ الْقِيَامَةِ Who is more farther astray than the person who is calling upon whom Calling upon him besides Allah, who is not going to answer him till the day of resurrection. And they are unawares that somebody is calling upon them. The angels, they don't know that some, some people are there in Arabia praying to us, calling to us. Maybe the souls and spirits of the saints. They might be absolutely unaware that someone is saying, Ya Shaykh Abdul Qadir Jilani Shayyan Lillah, Oh Shaykh Abdul Qadir Jilani, give me something. They would be unawares. وَهُمْ عَنْ دُعَائِهِمْ قَافِلُونَ وَإِذَا خُشِرَ النَّاسُ قَالُوا لَهُمْ عَادَان And when the mankind will be gathered, they will become enemies for them. وَكَانُوا بِعِبَادَتِهِمْ قَافِرِينَ and they will deny having been worshipped. وَإِذَا تُطْلَعَ لَهِمْ آيَاتُنَا بَيِّنَاتٍ 
And when our clear and shining revelations are recited unto them, قَالَ الَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا لِلْحَقِّ لَمَّا جَاهُمْ هَذَا سَيْرُ مُبِينَ Those people who disbelieve, who have rejected, they say about this truth which has come to them, this is clear sorcery and magic. أَمْ يَقُولُونَ افْتَرَاهُ Do they say that Muhammad has forged it, composed it himself, صلى الله عليه وسلم, قُلِنْ افْتَرَيْتُهُ فَلَا تَمْلِكُونَ لِي مِنَ اللَّهِ شَيَا Say, if I have forged it, then you don't have any authority to save me from Allah's wrath. This is the biggest crime in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. فَلَا تَمْلِكُونَ دِي مِنَ اللَّهِ شَيَا You won't be able to help me against Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. هُوَ عَالَمُ بِمَا تُفِيدُونَ فِي He very well knows what you say among yourselves concerning it. When you are alone, you say, no, this what Muhammad is presenting, well, it seems to be beyond human power. They say, no, 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 where are you going? It seems, you know, his magic has come over you. So, but these in their private meetings, they used to admit, this is our other source. This is not, him. This is not the composition of Muhammad himself. كَفَى بِهِ شَهِدًا بَيْنِ وَبَيْنَكُمْ Allah is sufficient as a witness between you and me. وَهُوَ الْغَفُرُ الرَّحِيمُ And He is the forgiving, the merciful. قُلْ مَا كُنْتُ بِدَعَ مِنَ الرُّسُلِ Say, I am not the first messenger that no messenger had come before me. بِدَعَ and بِدَعَ means something absolutely new. In our Sharia, if some new rite or ritual is invented without having any proof in the Sunnah of Muhammad and the Sunnah of the Sahaba, then we call it Bidah, because it has no roots. So, Ma Kunto Bidah Minar Rasul. The case is not that I am the first messenger of Allah and nobody had before me claimed to be messenger of Allah. Wama Adima, you follow me. This ayah, when I, whenever I read and pass by it, I shiver. What is Muhammad saying, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and what he is being commanded here to say? وَمَادْرِ مَا يُفَدُوا بِي وَلَا بِكُمْ I don't know what will be done to me and to you. This is extreme humility before Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala. My battle is in the hand of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Whatever he will decide. Allahumma inni abduka wa abnu abdika wa abnu amatika fi qabzatika nazil fiya hukmuka adlul fiya qadaauka Oh Allah, I am your bondsman. My father was also a slave of yours. My mother was also a slave of yours. And I am in your grip, fi qabzatika. Nasiyati biyadik. My forehead is in your hand. Mazil fi yahukmuk. Within my body, within myself, your command, your command is effective. Adlul fi yaqazaw. Whatever you command and decide for me, it will be justice. This is abdiyah. The climax of abdiyat. A man reduces himself to nearly zero. I have nothing to Allah. Everything is with you. You know everything, I know nothing. This is a part of that very important dua of istikhara, about which the companions of the Prophet say that the Prophet taught us this, this prayer. Just like he taught us Quran. Allahumma inni astakhiru ka bi'ilmi ka wa astakhdiru ka bi'qudrati ka wa asaluka bin fazlika al-asim. Fa inna ka taqdiru wa la akhdiru wa ta'alamu wa la alamu. You have all the authority, I have no authority. You know everything, I don't know anything. This is humility, humbleness before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. 
قل ما كنت بدعا من الرسل وما ادري ما يفعل بي ولا بكم ان اتبع الا ما يوحى الي only i am following what is being revealed to me that's all وما انا الا نذير مبين and i am only a warner plain and clear warner قل ارايت من كان من عند الله وكفرت به وشاهد شاهد من بني اسرائيل على مثله say to them just consider if this quran which i am presenting is really from allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you have rejected it on the other hand a witness from among the children of israel he has testified that this is correct now this i about the interpretation of this ayah there are many opinions one is that it's common all the people who accept quran accepted quran from among the bani israel yahud so this ayah denotes to them one opinion is especially abdullah ibn salam radiyallahu ta'ala anhu he was a very knowledgeable person among the learned people of jews and some say this denotes to the prophecies made by hazrat musa and hazrat isa alayhi salatu wassalam wallahu alam famana wastakbartu so he confirmed and you are showing arrogance in la la yadil qaum zalimin verily allah doesn't love such evil doers wa qala alladhina kafaru lil ladhina amanu law kana khairam ma sabquna ilayhi and so said those who disbelieved regarding those who came to believe they were common people poor people some of the slaves some of whom you call handy men just as khabab al arab he was a blacksmith and so on and so forth now the chiefs of the clans of quraish they said had this thing been a precious thing these people would not have come forward accepted them we should have come forward first and accepted it because allah is generous to us he has given us wealth he has given us position honor power so how how come that these menials maazallah how could they come forward they could not have superseded us and they would disbelieve say of those who believe if this message what a good thing they would have not attained it before us wa islam yahtadu bihi and when they have not accepted its guidance so they aqulu da hada iskul qadim so now they will say this is an old falsehood wa min qablihi kitab musa imam wa rahma before this quran there was a book of moses alayhi salatu wassalam that was the guide and mercy imam wa rahma these words appear in our dua our prayer regarding when we say to allah allahumma rabbana anis fahshatana fi quburina warhamna bil quran al azim waj'al lana imama wa nuran wa hudan wa rahma make this quran leader for us so that we follow it imama wa rahma wa hadha kitabun musaddiqun lisan al arabiyyan and this is the book which has come confirming torah in arabic language lajunzal alladhina zalamu so that these people who have gone astray they should be warned wa bushra lil muhsinin and so that there should be glad tidings for those who achieve excellence in their deen of islam and iman inna alladhina qalu rabbana allah wa do muhsinin there is those who said our lord is allah and then they stuck to it they stood firm in it firm regarding aqida and creed firm regarding practice and deeds really obeying him and not obeying anyone else in which there comes a disobedience for allah subhanahu wa taala not loving anything anyone more than allah this is istiqama to say rabbul allah is easy but to show firmness on it is not an easy job allah ibn bal said in persian 
to me goyam musalmanam bil larzam when i say i am a muslim i tremble why kadanam mushkilat la ilaha i know what are the difficulties of this la ilaha illallah saying this word these words is very easy but to fulfill them in your practice and action is not an easy job so i tremble ان الذين قالوا ربنا الله ثم استقاموا فلا خوف عليهم ولا هم يحزنون فدم ذي بن نو فير اند نو غريف اولئك اصحاب الجنه دي ويل بي دي ديولرز اوف دي جاردن خالدين فيها اند دي ويل ستي ذير فور ايفر فور ايفر جزاء بما كانوا يعملون ان شيل بي دي ريكمبنس اوف ريوارد فور وات دي هاد بين دوينج وہ بس ہے نا انسان ابھی والد ہے اینڈ وی ہیو انجوائنڈ اپون مین کائنڈنس ٹوورڈس ہز پیرنٹس دس وی ہیو ریڈ ان سورۃ الرحمن الصو بٹ ہیئر احسانا دس ورڈ ہیز کم کلیئرلی کائنڈنس اینڈ گڈ بیہیویئر اینڈ ریسپیکٹ اینڈ سروس ٹو دی پیرنٹس حملت امہ کرہن و وضعت ہو کرہا his mother kept bearing him in his womb with hardship and then delivered him with hardship wa fisaluhu 30 shahra wa hamluhu wa fisaluhu and this period of the bearing and the weaning of him is 30 months hatta iza balagha shuddahu until when he reaches his maturity wabalagha arba'ina sanatan and reaches the age of 40 this place is very important quran says the maturity of human beings is at the age of 40 what type of maturity is it physical maturity 16 17 18 you are mature fully but this is the psychological maturity the psychological maturity of a person it is at 40 years hatta iza balagha ashuddahu until when he reaches his maturity aur usko and now it has been explained wa balagha arba'ina sanatan that is he attained the age of 40 qala rabbi auzini now he says oh my lord grant me ان اشکر نعمتک التی انعمت علی و علی والدی سو دیٹ آئی کین گیو تھینکس ٹو یو فار آل دی بلیسنگز دیٹ یو بیسٹورڈ اپون می ان مائی پیرنٹس وان عامل صالحا عامل صالحا ان گرانٹ می دیٹ آئی شوڈ ڈو گڈ ڈیڈس رائٹس ڈیڈس ترضا ہو وچ یو لائک ود وچ یو آر پلیسڈ واس لہ لی فی ذریتی and also make my progeny good for me if my progeny is also righteous the dear deeds will add to you know my reward in the hereafter asli li fi zurriyati inni tubtu ilaik i turn my face towards you wa inni min almuslimin and definitely i am from among those who have surrendered themselves before your will this is very important before this age of 40 let me say that nature uses man man comes to himself at the age of 40 nature is using us nature wants that there should be procreation this generation after generation this world is to continue it has to be inhabited so you know it run away run this way that way get married now your children now just bring them up so nature is using you until this age passions emotions sentiments in most of the peoples they get the upper hand but at the age of 40 you know these things 
somewhat settled down. And there, then in, the man thinks who I am, where I am heading, and at this stage, if he is still a tool in the hands of his id or libido, then he is doomed. But at this age, if he delivers himself from the overpowering of the id or libido, comes to himself, he takes up to himself an ideal, an asmal ayan, I have to live for this, die for this. قُلْ إِنَّ صَلَاتِي وَنُسُكِي وَبَحْيَايَ وَمَمَاتِ اللَّهِ رَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ So he is the person blessed by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. أُولَائِكَ الَّذِينَ نَتَقَبَّلُوا عَنْهُمْ أَحْسَنَ مَا عَمِلُوا They are those from whom we shall accept the best deeds that they would have been committing. وَنَتَجَاوَزُ عَنْ سَيِّعَاتِهِمْ And we shall just overlook their evils. There can be no human being absolutely free from any bad deed. There is a hadith of the Prophet, Kullu bani Adama khattawun wa khairul khattayin attawabun. All children of Adam, they commit mistakes. But the best among these people who commit mistakes are those who repent, come back, refresh their covenant with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Ask his forgiveness. They are the best people. So now Allah says, we shall just ignore. Maybe they have committed something wrong also. But if the general direction of the life, general direction is correct, you have turned your face actually to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. إِنِّي وَجَّهْتُ وَجْهِيَ لِلَّذِي فَتَرَ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْلَرْضَ حَنِيفًا وَمَعَنَ مِنَ الْمُشْرِكِينَ You are proceeding in that direction. But during this journey, maybe at some time you slip, you fall. Okay, no harm. Stand up. Continue the journey. So these pitfalls might be there. But the direction has to be correct. And if your direction is correct, maybe you have not been able to achieve much, no harm. If you kept on in that direction and you kept on spending whatever you had for that purpose, well, you are successful in the eyes of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Despite the pitfalls, despite any shortcomings, despite any evil deeds which might have happened, and we join them, make them enter and go with the dwellers of the garden. This is the true promise which was made with them. Now this is one character, that when he is mature psychologically, he says, He has come to know his Creator, his Lord, and is praying to him. But there is another character also. وَالَّذِي قَالَ لِوَالِدَيْهِ On the contrary, the one who says to his parents, اُفِّلْ لَكُمَا Fai to both of you. أَتَعِدَانِ نِيَنْ اُخْرَجَ You say that I will be taken out again from my grave. وَقَدْ خَلَتِ الْقُرُونَ مِنْ قَبْلِ So many generations have passed before me. وَهُمَا يَسْتَغِيسَانِ اللَّهَ وَإِلَكَ آمِنْ and the parents, father and mother, they are imploring Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and saying to him, Woe to thee! Believe! Believe that you will be resurrected. Don't go in the opposite direction. Verily, the promise of Allah is true. Then he says, No, no, no. Mother and father, you keep these things with you. I am not going to believe in these things. I think these are the fables of the ancients and nothing else. So both characters you will find in the world. Those are they against whom has been proved through the word of chastisement among the communities of the jinn and mankind that have passed away before them. So many people going. He is also one of them. In Nahum Kanu Khasarin, verily they were delusers. 
ولی کل ان درجات میں معاملو اینڈ فار آل دیر آر رینکس اکارڈنگ ٹو دیئر ڈیڈس آل پیپل آف دی گارڈن آر ناٹ ایکول دیر آر لیولس ان دی سیم وے ان دی ہیلتھ دے آر ناٹ ایکولی ٹریٹڈ ڈفرینٹ ٹائپس آف چیسٹائزمنٹس فار ڈفرینٹ ٹائپس آف پیپل ولی یو آف یہ ہوم آم آلہم ہم لا یوز لمون سو دیٹ اللہ پیز دیم بیک ان فل دیئر ڈیڈس اینڈ دے آر ناٹ رانگ یوم یور الزین کفر و النار اینڈ دی ڈے وی کال دی ڈے وین دوز پیپل ہو آر ڈس بلیونگ دے ول بی پریزینٹیڈ بفور دی فائر دس از کم اینڈ سی ود یور آئز اظہر تم تو یہ بات کروں فی الحیات فی حیات کو مت دنیا اینڈ اٹ ول بی سیڈ یو ریسیوڈ آل گڈ تھنگس ان دی ان یور لائف آف دیٹ ورلڈ which is now gone. You enjoyed. You rejoiced. You had plenty. You had the luxuries. You have tasted all good things in that world. And you have enjoyed their comfort. But today, this day, You will be given the reward, the chastisement of humiliation and degradation due to the arrogance that you are showing in the earth, in earth, the very haq without any right. And because of your transgressing. Vaskur akhaad. Just make a mention of the brother of the nation of Aad. That is, Hazrat Ehud alayhi salatu wassalam. After the people of Nuh were destroyed, that was the first nation which came up from the sons of Sam alayhi salatu wassalam. Semitic races. The first was who went down directly to the south and settled in the southern area of the Arabian Peninsula, which is now called Ahqaf. Akhaf means the mountains of sand. It's a very, very, very severe type of desert. And, but at that time, it was very fertile. Now, when the Azab of Allah came, chastisement after that, it is now the worst, worst ever desert in the world. Vaskur Akhaad, now just mention, Make mention of the brother of Aad, that is Hud alayhi salam, is under a qawmahu bil ahqaf. When he warned his people in the sand hills, وَقَدْ خَلَتِ النُّدُرُ مِنْ مَيْنِ يَدَيْهِ وَمِنْ خَلْفِهِ And other warners had passed before him also. And so, you know, Nabi and Rasul, many Anbiya can come. But finally, the messenger comes, the Rasul comes, and then the fate is decided. Allah ta'abudu illallah, all of them had been saying them, don't worship and obey anyone except Allah. Inni akhafu alaykum azaba yawmin azim. Verily, I fear for you the chastisement of a mighty day. Qalu ajaytana le taafikana an alihatina. They said, have you come to us? And you want to turn us away from our gods? Fatina bima ta'iduna in kuntam in the If you are truthful, now bring to us the chastisement which you are threatening us with. Bring it. Ta'ala innam al-ilma inna Allah. He said, knowledge is with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. When your terms, your term comes to an end, he knows. When The judgment will be issued by Allah, He knows. I don't know. I am only conveying to you the message with which I have been sent. But verily I see, oh my people, that you are ignorant people. You are not seeing what could happen. 
فلما راہ آردن مستقبل اودیت ہی اینڈ ون دے سو اے سڈن کلاؤڈ ایڈوانسنگ ٹوڈس دیئر ویلیز کالو دے ور ہیپی کالو ہاگا آرد النوم ترونا دس از اے کلاؤڈ اٹ ول گیو اس رین بل ہوا مستاجل تم بھی نو 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 اٹ از ناٹ دی رین اٹس دیٹ چسٹائسمنٹ اباؤٹ وچ یو وانٹیڈ ٹو ہیسن یو وانٹیڈ رین اوکے دیٹ از کم ریہن فی ہا عذابن علیم اے ویری سٹرانگ اینڈ ہارش ونڈ ان وچ دیر واز اے پین فل چسٹائسمنٹ تو دم میرو کل شہین ڈسٹرائنگ ایوری تھنگ بے امر رب بے ہا جو تو دی لارڈ of their due to the command of their lord fasbahu la yura illa masakidhum now they became that nothing was seen nothing was visible except their dwellings people who dwell there they were not to be seen finished kadhalika najzil qaum al mujrimin in this way we reward the people who are guilty wa laqad makkarnahu fi ma in makkarnaku fi and o quraish We established them in the, is this land more than we have established you. Whatever we gave to Aad, we have not given to you. وَجَعَلْنَا لَهُمْ سَمْعًا وَأَبْصَارًا وَأَفِدًا And for them also, we give them the, the hearing and seeing and inferring from أَغْنَا عَنْهُمْ سَمْعُهُمْ وَلَا أَبْصَارُهُمْ وَلَا أَفِدَتْهُمْ مِنْ شَيْءٍ Nothing of these faculties could avail them any, anything. إِذْ كَانُوا يَجْحَدُونَ بِعَيَاتِ اللَّهِ When they were rejecting the revelations of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala وَحَاقَ بِهِمْ مَا كَانُوا بِهِ يَسْتَحْزِهُونَ and the things about which they were mocking they came and they encircled him وَلَقَدْ أَهْلَكْنَا مَا حَوْلَكُمْ مِنَ الْقُرَى وَصَرَّفْنَا الْآيَاتِ لَعَلَّهُمْ يَرْجِعُونَ فَلَوْلَا نَصَرَهُمُ الَّذِينَ اتَّخَذُوا مِن دُونِ اللَّهِ قُرْبَانًا آلِهَةً بَلْ صدق اللہ العظیم دی لاسٹ سیکشن آف سورت الاحقاف وَلَقَدْ أَهْلَكْنَا مَا حَوْلَكُمْ مِنَ الْقُرَى and we destroyed many townships which were around you now who are addressed are the Quraysh of Mecca now Aad they used to live to the south east of Mecca Samud They used to live in the northwest of Makkah. So these were the nations round about Makkah. وَلَقَدْ أَهْلَكْنَا مَا حَوْلَكُمْ مِنَ الْقُرَاءِ وَصَرَّفْنَا الْآيَاتِ لَعَلَّهُمْ يَرْجِعُونَ And we verily expounded our revelations for them in various forms so that they come back and return to us. فَلَوْ لَا نَصَرَهُمُ الَّذِينَ تَخَذُوا بِالدُّونِ اللَّهِ قُرْبَانًا عَلَيْهَا Then why did not those help him, whom they have taken as mediator gods besides Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? They couldn't come to their help. But all of them were lost to them. And it was their lie, a forgery. And that was what they were forging. Now this incident which is being mentioned here now, it took place in the 10th year after the beginning of Wahi to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. That is to say about two years before Hijrah. In the 10th year after the beginning of Wahi, and this year the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam gave the title Aamul Huzn. This is the year of grief for us. Why? Number one, Khadiyat al-Kubra رضي الله تعالى عنها died. A wife who used to console, she has gone. Number two, Abu Talib died. The chief of the clan of Banu Hashim who used to protect, gone. Now, there was no support, visible support. For Muhammad at Makkah. His own people were not so strong. Not more than 100, 125 people total. They couldn't withstand the whole power of Quraysh. 
So that is why he went to Taif. Maybe if some chief of the tribes of Taif accepts Islam, then he can shift there and that would become the base of his movement. But what happened to him there had not happened to him personally even in ten long years at Makkah. He was stoned, he bled like anything, then very harsh words he had to listen, not only from the three chiefs, all three of them rejected him, but also they instigated the youth, the street urchins, I should say, stoned him, and they were stoning him like anything. Now when he was returning from Taif, he stayed for the night at Nakhla. Nakhla is a point in between Makkah and Taif. There he was offering his Tahajjud prayer or maybe Fajr prayer, reciting Quran. At that time, a group of jinns passed by. They heard, they came nearer, listened to Quran. Then they believed in it. Then they went to their people, asking them to believe in Muhammad so this is a very important incident of the life of the prophets. Why is Sarafna ilayk a nafara min al jinn? And recall when we turn towards you, a group of the jinn, just tamiyoon al Quran, to hear the Quran. Falma hadaru, and when they were present there, where they were in the presence of Quran. They said, keep quiet, be silent, listen attentively. As we have read in Surah Al-Araf, فَإِذَا قُرِيَ الْقُرَانُ فَاسْتَمِعُوا لَهُ وَأَنْسِتُوا When Quran is being recited, now with full attention, listen to it and keep quiet. This, that is the word, أَنْسِتُوا, keep quiet. فَلَمَّا قُضِيَ And when, you know, the recitation was completed, وَاللَّهُ إِلَىٰ قَوْمِهِمْ مُنْزِرِينَ they turned their backs, they went to their people, their nation, warning them. Kalu, they said, Ya Kaumana, O oh, our people, our nation, Inna Samina Kitaban, we have heard and listened to a book, Unzula Mimade Musa, which has been sent down after Moses. This is another indication. They might have known Injil. But Injil was not a book, it was hikmah only. It was no sharia to be followed, no commandments, no halal and haram, no laws. So here they are mentioning after the book of Musa. Ya qawmana inna sabi'ina kitaban unzila min baadi Musa, musaddiqa lima bana yadahi. And this book confirms that which is present before us, that is Torah. Yahdi al haqq and this book is guiding towards the right path, truth. Wa'ila tariqi mustaqeen, and towards the straight path. Ya qawmana ajibu da'i Allah. Over people, respond to Allah's caller and summoner. Respond positively. Say labbaik to his call. Ajibu da'i Allah. Now this is very important. They heard and listened to Quran only once. And they became the Mubalibin. They became the callers. What's the case with us? Go on listening and listening and listening and listening. Every year listening. Every year listening. But we are not motivated. We don't stand. And call people to this book, or Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, or to Islam, actual Islam, factual Islam. Ya qawmana ajibu da'i Allahi wa aminu bihi. And believe in it. Ya qfid lakum min zunubikum. Your Lord will forgive you some of your sins. Wa yujirkum min azabin alim. And he will protect you and deliver you from the painful chastisement. وَمَنْ لَا يُجِبْ دَعِيَ اللَّهِ 
and whosoever doesn't respond to the Allah's summoner or caller, for there's a mojiz in Firdaus, he cannot defeat Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the earth. وَلَيْسَ لَهُ مِن دُونِهِ عَلِيَا And there will not be for him, besides Allah, any protectors. أُولَائِكَ فِي ضَلَالِ مُبِينَ Verily, those people will be in manifest error. أَوَلَمْ يَرَوْا أَنَّ اللَّهَ الَّذِي خَلَقَ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضَ وَلَمْ يَعْيَا بِخَلْقِهِنَّ بِقَادِرِنَ لَا يُحِيَ الْبَوْتَ Don't they see? Can't they understand that Allah who created the heavens and the earth and He was not tired or exhausted due to their creation? Is He not capable? بِقَادِرِنَ لَا يُحِيَ الْمَوْتَ To revive the dead. Bala, why not? He is capable. Innahu ala kudishayn qadir. He is definitely powerful over everything. Wa yawma yawradu alladhina kafaru wa annar. And recall the day when these people who disbelieve, they will be presented before the fire. Alaysa haza bil haq. And then they will be asked, is it not true? Is it some fiction? Was that some forgery of Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? You used to laugh at it. Alaysa hadha bil haq. Is this not the truth? Qalu bala wa rabbina. They should say, why not? And we swear by you, O our Lord, it is the truth. Qala fasuku al-azaba bima kuntum takfurun. And then finally Allah would say, okay then, taste the chastisement because of what you used to disbelieve. Now the final address to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. فَصْبِرْ كَمَا صَبَرَ عُلُ الْعَزْمِ مِنَ الرُّسُولِ So Muhammad, and they are patiently, just as our messengers of the past who had strong character and will, they endured. You know, the number of the prophets of Allah, due to, according to certain traditions, is 124,000. Messengers, 313. And this number somehow corresponds. 124,000 Muslims were present on the eve of last Hajj of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And 313 were with him in the battle of Badr. The same number as is of the messengers. Out of these five or seven, mostly five, they are said to be Ulul Azmi min al Rusul. People of the strongest character, strongest forbearance. And they are the same which we read in Surah Al-Shura. شَرَعَ لَكُمْ مِنَ الدِّينِ مَا وَصَّى بِهِ نُوحًا وَالَّذِيَ وَعَيْنَا إِلَيْكَ وَمَا وَسَيْنَا بِهِ إِبْرَاهِيمَ وَمُوسَى وَعِيسَى Five. Nuh, Ibrahim, Musa, Isa, and Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم وَعَلَيْهِمُ الصَّلَاةُ وَالسَّلَامُ Some people add two more to this list. Hud and Saleh. But most need to agree that these five are the topmost. فَصْبِرْ كَمَا سَمَرَ رُلْعَزْمِ مِنَ الرُّسُلِ وَلَا تَسْتَعْجِلْ لَهُمْ Don't make haste for them. Don't think that their term should come to an end. I have conveyed them the message. Now the matter should be judged and finally decided. How long will they be given the respite? No, no, no. وَلَا تَسْتَعْجِلْ لَهُمْ don't hasten to them on the on them the chastisement. The day when they will see what was being promised to them, they will feel Lam Yal Basu, they never remain illa satam in Naharin. Except for one hour of a day. This whole life in this world which they are passing. This will appear that they live here only for an hour of the day. 
بلاغ خازا دس از خازا بلاغن بلاغ دس از ٹو کنوے ٹو یو فہل یوہ لکو الا القوم الفاسقون سو ہو ویل بی ڈسٹرائڈ ایکسپٹ دوز پیپل ہو آر دی ٹرانسگریسرس